Now, one of the interesting things about the Transit Connect is what you can actually do with that third row. There are a few different ways that you can fold the seats down. Let's go through a couple of them right now. So, if we want to just fold this down just for easy storage, all we're going to do, as you can see there, we do have a couple different levers. We're going to start off with the red one. We're just going to crank that up, and as you can see, it folds it down. And as you can see in the back, we also have this little guy. So we can fold that up and over if we need a little bit of storage space and then easily pull it back down. That's way number one. Now, in order to lift the seat back up, very straightforward. It's a little bit awkward from the back of the vehicle. It's a little bit easier to lift it back up from the inside, but it's not impossible. All we're gonna do is grab the black lever. We're just gonna crank it back up into place. So you can do that for both of the captain's chairs in the back row. But there's one other way that we can fold these seats down, makes it a little bit different. Let's have a look. The other way that we can fold the seats down, very, very straightforward, but very interesting. So I've seen this in the EcoSport, but it, it's very, very different in the Transit Connect. So there's a tab at the very back. We can lift that tab up in order to fold the seat flat down. Now, as I said, it is a little bit easier to get the seat up and down inside of the vehicle. So if you see there, we've got a little red tab. We're just gonna pull the red tab up and then we're just gonna lift the seat forward but look at that, it folds it nice and flat now and same thing. If we grab this tray, lift it up and over, all of a sudden we've got an even flatter surface. Look at the big difference between that side, the driver versus the passenger side. So huge, huge difference, left side versus right side. And all we had to do was simply fold that bottom part of that back seat down first. So huge difference on the left versus the right side. Now that's one of the benefits of this thing is because the seats are separated like that, if you need a five seater, you've got the ability to do that while also still giving yourself a ton of options for storage space. 